But, um, Minister Doherty announced over the weekend that uh, she intended to launch a campaign uh, in relation to bogus uh, self-employment. Uh, now that's welcome, if uh, somewhat late in the day, uh, given that there's been people protesting about that for years now, but nonetheless it is welcome. But can I ask, is it going to include other forms of precarious and insecure uh, employment? And I ask that specifically because uh, today uh, 100 film workers or more protested outside the Minister for Arts and the Minister for Enterprises offices. I was there with them. Uh, this is the latest of a series of protests they've held uh, because uh, they say there is rampant abuse of workers' rights in the film industry and they are particularly angry that conditions attached to the 70 million euro a year of public money that goes into the film industry is supposed to be attached to a condition of quality employment and that in reality there isn't quality employment there's, they say, blacklisting, insecure employment, you, uh, people uh, uh, being uh, refused further employment in the industry Time if they uh, raise now, issues please. of health and safety, uh, of overtime, of excessive hours being worked, uh, and so on, and that there is no policing whatsoever of these public monies uh, and the precarious conditions that many Thank workers you, in this industry are suffering. Will they be in this campaign uh, because they have requested several meetings with ministers on these issues and have been refused those meetings. Taoiseach. Oh, Minister. 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 Thanks, um, Deputy Barrett, for um, raising the issue. Um, we didn't intend. We actually did launch uh, the campaign over the weekend, um, and I would very much welcome everybody, uh, both in this House and outside of this House, um, uh, encouragement to ask people to contact us um, if they do feel that they are in uh, a self-employed status, uh, not through their own making. So to answer your specific question, there's no industry that's excluded from this. But what we're trying to ascertain is that people who are um, registered as self-employed, not through their own choice. Um, and I think the people that you're referring to, and I haven't actually received a, a meeting request, so if you want to um, ask them to contact me, I'm happy to meet anybody, but the people that I think that you're referring to are actually employees as opposed to being made to be self-employed in the main and may have difficulties with regard to their conditions and the Workplace Relations Commission is there and the Labour Courts are there uh, to assist those people and also the new piece of legislation that we're bringing to committee stage I think on the 17th of this month if I'm to be corrected um, should bring further strengthening uh, employment rights to those people who are on precarious and low paid contracts. Thank you Minister Deputy. Employers um, eligible to be able to give those information within five days of them taking up employment. But if you want to get them to contact me, I can certainly. Deputy Matthew McGrath.